My name is Madison McDowell and this is my Nursing 230 Physical Assessment Part 1. Hello. <laughs> Hello, can you tell me your name and date of birth? Morgan McDowell, 7193. I'm going to do a physical assessment on you, okay? Okay. I'm going to start by looking at your skin. Do you mind removing your sweater? I mean, it's kind of chilly in here, but okay, sure. Sorry. Okay, so she's dry skin is warm there's no bruises no edema noted um i don't see any lesions no abnormal scarring her skin looks normal and her color is tan which is that normal for you yes <laughs> hopefully <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and look at your head i'm just gonna look for size and symmetry and everything looks symmetric and then i'll go ahead and palpate your head you're gonna feel me touch just let me know if anything feels out of the normal or painful okay mm -hmm. everything feels normal yes ma'am all right okay next i'm gonna go ahead and palpate your temporal arteries Does that feel normal? Mm-hmm. And then I'm gonna go ahead and start palpating your lymph nodes. Just let me know if anything is painful. I'm gonna come around behind you. Any pain? All right, so lymph nodes are good. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and check your cranial nerve five. So what I'm gonna have you go ahead and do is clench down. I'm just gonna palpate here. Any pain, any tenderness, no? Okay. And then just let me know if you can feel this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she was able to feel all light touch sensation. We're gonna go ahead and move on to cranial nerve seven. Um, I'm going to check for facial symmetry, so go ahead and smile for me, frown, puff your cheeks out, and make the duck face for me. So everything looks symmetric. Um, go ahead and raise your eyebrows, and that looks normal as well. Next, I'm going to go ahead and move on to the ear. So first thing I'm going to do is just look at the outer ear shape and position. So I'll look at both sides, look inside. Everything looks normal. And same on this ear, everything looks normal. I'm just gonna palpate the pinnae and tragus. Any pressure or pain? Mm -mm. Any pressure or pain? <laughs> Sorry, I had a noisy house. Okay, next we're gonna go ahead and move on to cranial nerve eight. This is gonna be the whisper test first, then we'll do the Weber and the Ryan test. So first thing I'm gonna do is come behind you. Go ahead and cover your right ear for me. I'm gonna whisper a number. Go ahead and repeat it back to me. 17. Okay, go ahead and switch ears for me. 22. Perfect, so that looks good. We'll go ahead and move on to the Weber and Ryan test. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna strike my tool here. I'm gonna place it on top of your head. Let me know when the vibration stops. And I'm gonna move it to the side of your ear. Let me know when the vibration stops. And then I'm gonna put it next to your ear. Let me know when you don't hear the sound any longer, okay? No, okay. It's fine. And let me know if you can hear that. Mm -hmm. Let me know when it stops. It stopped. Okay, we'll go ahead and move on to the next ear. It stopped. It stopped. You can hear that? Let me know when it stops. It stopped. Okay, so that's the Weber and Rhyme test. Next thing I'm gonna do is move on to the eye. So first I'm gonna inspect the lashes, the brows, and the fissures. So everything looks normal, lashes are symmetric eyebrows, fissures, everything looks good. I'm gonna go ahead and inspect the sclera and conjunctiva. White, no bruising to the eye. 
Pleura and conjunctiva look normal. There's no lesions, no abnormal discharge out of the eye. Next thing I'm gonna do is do our gross visual acuity. So I'm gonna hold this up. Can you cover your left eye for me? Go ahead and tell me what this letter is. R. And this letter. N. Go ahead and switch eyes. Tell me what this letter is. S. And this letter. R. Now both eyes. N. U. Okay, so you have 20-20 vision. Next, I'm going to check cranial nerve two. So I'm going to do this by checking her peripheral vision. So go ahead and cover your right eye for me. I'm going to hold up a number to the side. Let me know what the number is, okay? Two. Three. Four. Switch eyes for me. Two. Four. Five. Okay, so peripheral vision is good. Next thing I'm going to check is the pupil response to light. So just look straight ahead for me. Both eyes were reactive to light right now. The pupils are about three millimeters. Um, they're equal, so that's good. Next thing I'm gonna do is check for accommodation for cranial nerve three. So I'm gonna do this by moving the pen light in and see if she's able to follow it. Okay, so cranial nerve three is good. We'll go ahead and move on to cranial nerve three, four, and six. So I'm gonna do this by checking the six cardinal fields of vision. So just follow my pen light for me. Don't move your head, just your eyes, okay? All right, very good. So next we'll go ahead and move on to the nose. So first thing I'm gonna do for that is just inspect the nose, make sure it's midline and that looks good. Go ahead and palpate. So the nose is good. I'm gonna go ahead and check nasal patency. Any trouble breathing? Okay, next I'll go ahead and palpate the frontal and maxillary sinuses. <laughs> Again. All right, so that's good. So that concludes part one of this video.